awesome. This magazine is very very close to my heart because it speaks the true sense of what, what one wants to speak. It speaks a soul, it speaks an, an educator's soul. It's uh, very useful and I, I get 10 copies every month and this copies actually go to my staff rooms. It goes to everyone who wants to, it's a free reading, even for my children. Because I think the biggest learners are children and the biggest teachers are children. So the substance and the, and the way it's created, I give 10 out of 10. Most appropriate and most relevant. Why I say that? Not because conformity, because we all believe in, and it's been a, it's been a very long used word which is going on. And uh, now the education way, the education sector and the services are now changing very rapidly. I think we really need to be looking towards its sustainability because uh, not only are we evolving education, not only are we carrying everyone, we are hand-holding everyone and uh, progressing. And that's what the deliberations which are going on in the, in the conference here. I think they are so useful and I, I feel sorry for the people who have not attended because um, I know there are many conferences happening all over the country and all over the world but I particularly feel this, what if they have not attended, I can only term them as the losers. Give everyone the space and to children especially I want to say don't listen to anyone, just do what your heart says to do and to the educators I say don't stop children of doing anything what they want. Give them a complete freedom, give them a complete space. Don't put barriers, don't put frameworks. Let them have a complete independence of doing whatever they want. Because if we start putting the, you know, the taboos on them and we start putting the restrictions, we'll never let their creative mind come up. So I think uh, my, my tagline would be hash freedom.